Welcome back to Mortar Archery. Today we talk about frequently asked questions again. Many people ask me when you shoot thumb draw, where in the face is your anchor point? Now you need to see in Chinese archery they don't really have an anchor. To this I come later and when you check in Arab archery or like the Ottomans and the Turks shot they have a few different anchor points in their face and even different opinions on this. What you need to know first is that the Ottomans didn't have a very long draw length so they shot normally 27-28 inches draw length which is nearly the same what we do here so anchor point is supposed to be nearly the same so so when you see and it is I refer here to really competent people in Turkey Murat Özferi he said that and they have the anchor point with 28 or 27 inch draw they anchor seriously here in the corner of their mouth like we do in Mediterranean so this is the first one so you can when you shoot short draw length of 28 inches bring the hand bring the thumb knuckle of the thumb to the corner of your mouth the other one is I saw one he is now bringing back the history and culture of Ottoman archery he said you shall bring the soft part here, the web, as we say, on your chin here. So that would look like this. Then you still have sort of 28 inches draw, and you shoot like this, anchor point here. Overall, there is no right or wrong. What feels good for you, simply shoot. But when you want to get it historically correct, then go for this. Arab archery mentioned five different ways to anchor. The first one is the eye anchor, where you bring the hand to the farthest back point of your eyebrow. It looks like this. Some people here in Malta may recognize one who is shooting like this. He draws always here and then shoots. Oh, I missed because I'm not an eye anchor archer. Uh, it's mentioned in Arab archery that this way of anchoring was meant to be when you are in a higher position and you have to shoot downwards but they say it's not the best because you shoot blind so this and it's really like this you don't see anything so I anchor not for me the next anchor one of the more common ones is anchor on your earlobe and this is I think one of the most popular ones and you need a little longer arrows these are 29 inches here then you can anchor on your earlobe the arrow is still quite high here it's a nice feeling this is anchoring on the earlobe the next anchor point mentioned is this part under the ear behind your beard or at the end of the jaw, so to say, where the jaw makes this angle here, this corner. It's a nice one too. And feels for me most natural. So yellow would be a little too high for me. This one is good for me. And then of course there is the moustache anchor. Because the Turks always had their moustache and they said you should anchor where the moustache goes into your normal beard like this looks like this short draw of course again and close to corner of your mouth so these are these anchors in the face and then of course like everywhere there is even the anchor point to the throat or to the chest sort of like this this is mentioned again as a not quite good and quite accurate shot and it's more for flight shooting, long distance shooting, but not for accuracy. Like we have it in Mediterranean, three fingers here, 
three fingers here or chest draw like they shoot from horseback. It's working but it's not that accurate they say. So my preferred draw in Turkish archery is seriously here. Not the earlobe, it's sort of here, end of the jaw. 29, 30 inches, you can go a little further back when you have 30 inches and you still have this nice anchor point here. So, and then when you get used to one anchor point, use it and you will see you will shoot instantly accurate. That was for Arab Turkish archery. The Chinese way, uh, they don't have really an anchor point in the face. Their anchor point or reaching full draw is always when the tip of the arrow reaches a certain point on the draw hand. There are some ways where you have the index finger pointing forwards. When your tip reaches the index finger, you reach full draw or the tip comes here to the knuckle of your thumb to the rear knuckle of your thumb. These are all mentioned, so to say, as your anchor points. Because when you shoot longer draw, more than 30 inches, say it's 32 inches, you're already beyond your face, so there is no chance to have a knocking point here anymore. So there is simply, you feel see the, the, the feathers here somewhere, or the arrow here, under the ear, because what you have to make sure is that you line everything up. You see, elbow, shoulder, shoulder, hand is in line. Only the bow arm shoulder is slightly down to have it locked. And then you draw 32 inches, let's say. Boom, like this. You anchor when you reach the full length of the arrow. Of course, this arrow is 36 inches, Manchurian length. And it looks like this. What you will feel in full draw when you do it properly, see, the tip is now on my fingers. What you will feel in full draw is the string touching your chest here. You see that? And you have the arrow sort of here running around your jaw when you do it properly. And then simply, boom, anchor point is here, not here back there anymore. One more time. See, anchor point, tip of the arrow, string touches your chest, and you listen to the string, that means the string is already beyond your ears. These are the points. Here you touch, string touches your body when you do it properly, and the string is already beyond your ears. You understand like this, let go anchor points in Chinese archery. So, no idea what I can tell you more. You have a lot of anchor points in Turkish archery, eyebrow, not recommended. So, Frankie, earlobe, highly recommended, even better the one in the corner of your jaw. For short draw lengths, when you do it really historically correct, only 27, 28 inches, you can anchor here. But I think this mouth anchor is same like moustache comes to the beard, that you anchor here somewhere and you have the arrow here on your mouth like we have when we shoot three fingers. And then the one where you have the web here under your chin, but maybe this is a short draw version. This would be then the long draw version in 30 inches, sort of. And then of course chest draw, but not recommended. Chinese, you saw when you reach full draw and the arrow comes to the end of the bow on your draw hand, and then it's done. So one more time, my preferred Turkish because I have one arrow left. Draw anchor, boom. Feels for me more comfortable than earlobe is a little too high for me. But simply shoot them all and figure out what works for you. What works for me must not work for you, the other way around. There is no right or wrong. What feels good for you, what works for you, simply do it. If you have questions about all this stuff, simply down in the comments. I'm always happy when I read something there. 
Otherwise, thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and like and all this stuff, you know, because we only can grow together. Uh, and then see you next time. Thank you very much. Bye bye.